If you're watching this video today, it means your guardian angels have an important message for you. An unexpected apology is coming your way, but you'll need to accept responsibility for your role in the conflict. The angels advise you to be open to a deep and genuine conversation. Something has occurred between you and a friend, lover, or family member, and the upcoming discussion won't be easy. It's with someone you've known for a long time and with whom you share a deep bond. You've journeyed together, grown, evolved, and connected in many ways on multiple levels. This bond could be a lifelong friendship or a soulmate connection. This person wants to apologize, but it won't be one-sided. They expect a genuine conversation with balance and unity as the primary goals. The message is to be open-minded and focus on diplomacy, mediation, and harmony as your affirmations and intentions. These are crucial for the conversation to go smoothly and for the connection to be preserved. This is not an ambush in any way. The catch doesn't have to be seen as negative, it's not a deceptive tactic to manipulate or control you, nor are there hidden motives to gain something from you, either emotionally or materially. This person's intentions for reconciliation are sincere. However, you need to be aware of your own triggers and blocks to harmony. We all have them. It's easy to assume others are cold, mean-spirited, or ineffective at addressing their shadows. However, if everyone is a mirror of us, a divine reflection, it is we who can unconsciously project and even cause drama or destruction. I repeat, an unexpected apology is on the way, but the catch is that you will need to accept accountability for your part in the conflict. Have you been denying your words, actions, or intentions? Yes, intentions can ripple out to affect physical reality. You may not need to say anything or take physical actions for something to happen or not happen. Sometimes, your will and continued projected thoughts are enough. Our intentions are powerful, they travel through space to affect people, places, and situations. Therefore, it's crucial to reflect on this situation to ascertain your intentions. You may have a strong will coupled with considerable influence over those around you, or you may be more passive and gentle with less physical force and presence. Regardless, your intentions affect everything within and around you. This person wants to apologize, but they won't be the only one explaining themselves. They expect you to be accountable, holding yourself responsible on some level just as they do. It would be wise to meditate on the concept of yin and yang, the universal principle of duality and oneness, where light flows into darkness and darkness flows back into light. We all have light and shadow attributes within us, and in almost all conflicts, both parties have some responsibility. This means you have some darker or shadow aspects that you need to acknowledge and take accountability for. This friend, lover, or family member will approach you with sincerity, humility, and a peace offering, but it's your job to meet them on their wavelength. Project loving reconciliation, harmony, fairness, and balance. Strive for longevity in your relationship even if it means making some compromises. You don't have to completely sacrifice yourself, but you should stay mindful of the eternal flow of energies within life and yourself. All relationships have that flow, and synergy should be your aim. Remember, this conversation won't be all doom and gloom. Even the trickier parts will be a great opportunity for healing and harmonization. There will be difficult moments, tension, social anxiety, and possibly a few heated words. Yet, we grow through our differences. 
There's a chance for unity and deeper connection amidst disparity and distortion. These are key moments to rebuild your bond, potentially making it stronger, more heartfelt, and sincere. Your bond can solidify in a way that allows for greater longevity. Be prepared to admit where and when you went wrong and also how you would have liked the other party to handle things differently. They will apologize, but they're not coming with a people-pleasing attitude, and neither should you. You can expect respect, compromise, and mutual understanding. The person apologizing is mature, emotionally intelligent, sensitive, self-aware, and intuitive just like you. They are wise for their age and have a lot of life experience and wisdom to draw from. The only catch with this apology is that you can't be the only angel in the situation. Everyone has an inner devil and an inner angel. This person has made peace with both, and you should too. Someone is coming towards you with an apology, and you should be gracious, humble, and receptive to their genuine words. This is an excellent opportunity to practice your diplomacy and mediation skills. This universal blessing will open a gateway to hidden or unseen abilities you might not even know you possess. Every conflict is a chance for healing, and through these experiences, your communication gifts can shine. Each serious discussion offers potential for self mastery. In this reconciliation, there will be a lot of kindness, warm feelings, and love. You will feel waves of fear, anxiety, love, and intimacy in equal measure, reflecting the dualistic forces of life. You will have a real opportunity to explore your own strengths and weaknesses. There will be much to learn and master in this conversation, so embrace this person with an open heart and a welcoming mind. You can fine-tune your communication skills to a high level, gaining respect, deeper connections, and appreciation. Whatever happens and whatever feelings arise, try not to react impulsively or let your emotions explode. Stay calm, eloquent, and elegant. Remember the importance of manners and respect both for the person bringing the apology and for your own boundaries and needs. Self-love is essential when this person approaches you with an apology. If you're sensitive and empathetic, you might find yourself slipping into old habits like trying to people please or appease others. Our advice is, don't. If you are headstrong and assertive, be mindful of not coming across as too direct or aggressive. Instead, try to take a more gentle and harmonious approach. Aim for balance in your opinions, perspectives, and observations, and when you speak, ensure it's from a place of cooperation. This apology will rock your world, especially if you've been waiting a long time. It may stem from a serious event that has caused you sadness and trauma for a while. Rest assured, your wounds will be healed, and peace, joy, and bliss will return. There's a great chance that this apology will also lead to abundance and financial prosperity, as it will boost your self-esteem and self-worth. Nothing negative will come from this, instead, a lot of good will manifest. This is a time for celebration, so stay mindful of your communication skills and exchanges, and watch as miracles unfold. This apology is a doorway to your higher self, as well as new connections and self-love that serves your spirit. Take a moment to let these words resonate with your spirit. Remember, you are loved and protected by the universe. Type Amen to claim this message and the blessings it holds for you. Try to leave a positive comment for other viewers who might need a positivity boost in their day.